protect every moment. You are not just watching a performance. You are witnessing a culture reborn. Now, you'll see what the modern world has never seen. China, before communism. Live on stage, Shen Yun 2021. Coming to Costa Mesa Segerstrom Center, December 30th through January 1st. Buy tickets now at ShenYun.com. 800-880-0188. The city of L.A. changes its vaccine mandate less than one week after it took effect. What you need to know before heading out the door this morning. Cheers and confetti as fans of Britney Spears learn the pop star is finally free. So what's next in her legal saga? And for the first time since the pandemic began, the Anaheim Convention Center is hosting a big event. We're live inside DesignerCon. Live from ABC7, this is Eyewitness News. Good morning, I'm John Gregory. And I'm Rachel Brown. Thank you so much for joining us this Saturday. As always, we're going to get things started with the forecast and another hot day. Oh, yeah, get ready for it. The heat is coming back again. We're going to see some 90s out there, as we saw yesterday. Burbank is 67 degrees right now. Yesterday, Burbank broke a record. It was 94 degrees, a record uh, that goes back to the 70s. So <laughs> got pretty warm, pretty hot for some people. Light, um, and, and a lot of people went to the beaches because it was just uh, so nice there. 71 degrees as the sun is shining bright right now. Here's a look at our highs today. We can see downtown LA and inland Orange County spots. Some will be in the high 80s. Others will hit low 90s today. Valleys and in Inland Empire right at about 90 or a little above. We look at our beaches, 81 degrees, so real warm on our beaches. Mountains will keep it cool at 64, but our high deserts, 80 degrees. There is light at the end of the tunnel. We're going to talk about cooler conditions that are coming a couple of days away. So, John, Rachel, we'll send it back to you. All right, things are changing. Thank you, Tony. More than a decade after losing power over her personal affairs and finances, Britney Spears is a free woman. A Los Angeles judge has formally ended the conservatorship that controlled Spears' life for close to 14 years. She can now make her own decisions regarding her relationships, her work, her health, and her money. It's also now up to Brittany whether to continue an investigation into how her father handled her multi-million dollar estate. How much money did you take from the estate? He better be scared because now that the conservatorship's over, it's just the beginning. We still have a lot of work to do. The pop star reacting to yesterday's news with this tweet saying in part, quote, best day ever, praise the Lord, can I get an amen? A heads up for anyone doing some holiday shopping in the city of Los Angeles today. Yeah, you'll now not have to show proof of vaccination at shopping centers and malls. Uh, the city of L.A. making that change in its COVID mandate simply because malls have too many entrances to try and regulate. Safe Pass L.A. went into effect earlier this week, requiring proof of vaccination to enter indoor restaurants, bars, salons, movie theaters, and other public places. Enforcement of the new ordinance starts later this month with businesses facing fines if they don't comply. Apply. Meanwhile, COVID restrictions in LA County are expected to last through the new year. If we continue with our current pace, we'll not reach the threshold of 80% before the new year. One of our four criteria for lifting the county.